what's up everyone adi here and in today's video i will be doing a review on the liquid smooth rom on my google nexus 5 so without any further wasting time let's get into the video This is the liquid smooth ROM on my Google Nexus 5 and this ROM is very fast, fluid and snappy and I have been using this ROM for last 15 days and I haven't noticed any lag or drop frame or whatsoever using this ROM and I can easily say you guys this is the smoothest ROM I have ever seen on my Google Nexus 5 and I just reinstalled the ROM to show you guys which ap applications it came with when you just install the ROM on your phone so take a look at the applications first you have audio effects, browser, calculator, two calendar applications. One is from the Google GF package and second one is which is pre-installed with this ROM. Then you have the camera application which is the Google camera. Let me show you. This is the camera application and I am pretty happy with the performance of the camera. The camera is good on this ROM. Then you have the clock, then contacts, then you have the dab tools. Let me show you then you have downloads email gallery gmail google which is google now then you have the google setting then you have g plus which stands for google plus then you have two messaging application two messaging application or messenger one is from the gfs again and second one is from the rom then you have the music application this is a simple music application then you have phone now just go to the setting menu and here you can see you just get all the common settings like other lollipop roms you have wi-fi bluetooth data usage nfc android beam then vpn mobile networks and emergency broadcast all these things then next you have the personalization menu where you can get liquid smooth layers and performance in the liquid smooth section you can change the interface uh, you can change the list view animations clock and alarm weather panel then calendar events then you have the lock screen settings you can change the weather customization and color on the weather settings uh, sorry lock screen setting then you have the navigation option you can set gesture anywhere option and app circle bar then you have the notification panel where you can set the notification light and you can choose missed call alert and voicemail if you want then you have other settings you can change the color of your notification LED and timeout section and you have the snows timer so you can set all of these cool things then then you have status bar option in the status bar you have the quick setting option option you, you can set the quick pull down and smart pull down then you have the traffic indicator brightness control and double tap to sleep it means when you double tap on your status bar the phone will go to sleep then you have the carrier level let me show you and i just turn turn it on and you can see the carrier appears at the top of my status bar and this rom is pretty customizable and i i like this rom for that then you have the battery bar option you can set your battery bar there then you have the battery indicator and battery styles uh, starter style so you can change it to circle or whatever you want you can see i just set it to the circle so you can see the battery icon changes to circle then you can you hide the battery percentage or you can show the battery percentage along with your battery status indicator then you have advanced option where you can block the ads then you have a option called misc you can here you can change the disable apps notification then you have the layer manager option you can set layers here and again this rom is pre-rooted so you don't need to install the super user separately because the uh, super user is pre-installed in this rom you have the performance step now and in the performance step you can monitor your cpu frequency and you can also set the minimum and maximum cpu frequency as your need and 
you can overclock your GPU and undervolt your CPU if you want and you have the color collaboration you can change the color of your home screen like the Franco kernel did and all these things are pretty good and you have home option you can choose any of the launcher you want and this the the ROM came with the Google Now launcher and Slim launcher and I just selected the Google Now launcher and after that, after that you have the display option you can change all of these settings if you want then you have the battery option and the battery of the battery performance of this ROM is pretty good I am getting around 7 to 8 hours of battery life with simple to moderate use and yeah the battery is pretty good and the the ROM is very snappy and all of these things are pretty good on a lollipop ROM and then you have the personal settings then you have the system settings you can change their dead time accessibility print printing developer option is pre present here then you have super and now you can see about phone section the android version is 5.0.2 which is lollipop and the rom is liquid smooth rom and the rom is very fast i am very happy with the performance of this rom and guys i think that's it for today and if you think this video is helpful then give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more android related news and roms for google nexus 5 or 4 and if i missed anything then please let me know in the comment section and if you have any questions or suggestion then please feel free to ask me in the comment section or leave that in the comment section and again thanks for watching see you in my next time peace